Welcome back to the natural world. Today we study the complex courting ritual of that fascinating creature, the human being. For humans, this waterhole is prime real estate for finding a mate. And here comes a female, Natalie. Do you see that sad, empty look in her eyes? She needs a man, but she can't find a nice one no matter where she looks. Nightclubs, prisons, Abercrombie and Fitch. A grazing herd passes. And one male, Stacy, is attracted by her scent, Chanel No. 5, the human equivalent of elk scat and pheromones. Natalie needs a mate, and Stacy needs grooming. A lot of grooming. There could be a symbiotic relationship in the works. Natalie shows an interest in Stacy, and Stacy likes her as well. So naturally, Natalie realizes she can do better. Poor over-eager Stacy. He is in what zoologists call the friend zone. Now enters a second male, James. He's become acquainted with Natalie through one chance encounter and 17 hours of Facebook research. He demonstrates his interest by making a solemn face, walking briskly past and completely avoiding eye contact. For some reason, she takes no notice. Can she find a mate before the onset of winter? Perhaps. The alpha male has spotted her. He sees that she has a fun and engaging personality. He can tell because she is super hot. A less dominant male might try at conversation, but he already knows everything he ever wants to know about her. He emits a mating call. Wait, no, it looks like a courting text. The female's interest is piqued. But wait, what appeared to be a ten-point buck is actually a pansy little fawn with a comb over. Badly wounded, the alpha male scampers away to nurse himself back to health with selfies and protein shakes. A rival female, Whitney, enters. She has a bad personality. Just look at her. Sensing Stacy is still frail from rejection, she closes in for the kill. Remarkable. Whitney, who has a personality only a mother could love, has won over Stacy. Crazier things have happened never. And Natalie is enticed by Stacy's unavailability, even though that is an idiotic dating strategy. The courtship is going well, and so Stacy, as males have done for centuries, sends a relationship request. Ooh, now the female is spooked. She may go on dates with Stacy and not anyone else, and they may kiss and hold hands and spend all their time together, but she's not his girlfriend. She makes for the woods, where she will overanalyze and regret her decision. <laughs> with Whitney out of the way, Natalie now has the idea of Stacy all to herself. James passes by randomly, as he does every 20 minutes. He now asks her out by nodding curtly and slowing his step. Incredibly, she does not respond. And so it is that nature has made these two a couple. Having secured mates, they are now free to abandon all dietary restraint and eat anything that holds still long enough. <laughs> Beautiful. Hey, thanks for watching that video. Now click on the button below and subscribe. We may not have funny videos about cats, but we do have funny jokes about... Um... Wales.